guys. I'd just like to take a minute before we begin to thank tonight's sponsor, which is a site called Skillshare. You may have heard of them before. I'd already heard of them before they approached me. In fact, I'd actually used some of their courses. They are an online learning community with many, many different creators and experts in their given field, putting together courses in a whole range of creative topics, everything from music, website design, YouTube building. Even ASMR YouTubers have courses on Skillshare, teaching you everything you need to get started. So if you're looking to put together a channel, if you'd like to get into website design, if you're looking to get into video game design, all these different things, there is definitely a Skillshare course just for you. Skillshare are giving the first 1,000 people who go to the link in the description a whole month for free to try it completely free. See if you like it. I'm sure that you'll find something on there and if there's a creative itch in you and you just feel like there's a new skill that you want to learn, definitely, definitely try it out because I'm sure you'll be surprised what you can pick up. Thank you very much to them for sponsoring tonight's video and I really hope you enjoy it. Thanks guys. Bye bye. Bye. Hello. Welcome back to the Midnight Spa. It's been some time since you were last here. Rest assured, we've been hard at work improving all of our treatments, taking inspiration from all over the world and combining it into a potent, relaxing, tingly rejuvenation experience. Now, as before, after you've had the treatments for your face, your scalp, your neck, and hair, and hopefully we've treated your mood. We have a selection of guest rooms in the back for you to sleep the night away and hopefully wake up feeling brand new. Now, I'm James. I'm going to be guiding you through your spa session this evening. As I'm sure you're aware, all guests are asked to fill in a questionnaire upon entry and this is used to help us make a tailor-made experience just for you. Everything from the, the room layout to the exact combination of scent we use in the candles, all personalized to make a custom experience. Sound good? Good, I'm sure you're going to be very relaxed by the end. Now we start with a uh, custom incense stick. This is a combination of scents that you listed as being pleasant and relaxing. So. Hopefully the smell permeates throughout the session and keeps you very relaxed. This is an incense stick holder. I'm going to be putting it on the side and just letting it waft through the air as we go. So we place this here. We take a lighter. Just allow that smoke to permeate through the air and mm, bring out a calming sensation. There's birch wood in there and uh, lavender. It's a beautiful combination of smells, if I do say so. I think we may adopt this one as a regular. We only take the best. And we see hundreds of guests, and every now and then we get the perfect new combination of flavors and smells. And we say, yeah, that's one that we'll have for our for our gift shop. Mm. We have a 
Excellent sunset. Hmm. An excellent taste, metaphorically. Mm. This helps to just relax your body before you begin and set us in the right frame of mind for the treatments. Okay, I'm going to put this on the side, right? next thing we do is we light a candle for each of our guests. Here we are. Obviously it's purely symbolic. It has no real bearing on the rest of the treatment, but when you see all the candles lined up and realize that each of the flames is a person that's been helped or relaxed by the experience, it's a very re rewarding sensation. This one is for you. And I'm going to pop this over here on the side, along with your custom incense stick. The room smells delightful. I really love that smell. So, we're going to begin with your hair tre treatments. You have beautiful hair. Just before I um, start, I've got my tablet on the side and I'm going to bring up your personal plan for tonight. There we go to make sure we get everything tailored and custom and correct. I've got some hair gloves here. Just gonna pop these on before I start working in your hair. Nice light plastic. Very thin. treatments are there is no rush we have all the time in the world too many of us go through our day with constant pressure it's nice to just leave it at the door going to start by spraying our hair with some nourishing oils. Don't worry, they may feel a little bit heavy when they go in, but when we wash it out later, it will really feel light and conditioned and gorgeous. that in, okay? Just using the tips of my fingers to gently massage your hair. condition. Looks like you take good care of it. Well done. It's very easy to neglect our hair and our skin and general 
self hygiene sometimes when life is really busy, but that's the whole point of sessions like this. You get to just relax and let somebody else sort it all out and bring out the most vibrant version of yourself. as I go. Start the room, pull through, and then massage at the end. Good. Starting at the room, pulling up through, massaging at the end. I'm just going to lightly massage it into your scalp as well. into the tips. There we go. Well done. I'm doing very well. Just making sure that oil nourishes and penetrates right down where we need it to go. Lovely. Okay, I'm just going to briefly massage the scalp now. You can close your eyes if you want. Mm -hmm. Feel nice? Good. I love having the back of my head massaged. Instantly relaxes me. And by the looks of it, so do you. Lovely. How does that feel? Okay, and we'll wash it out later, and you won't believe how good your hair feels. That's the gloves off. We're gonna move on to your face, okay? This area. An incredible amount of tension in our faces from bags under our eyes when we wake up to lines in our forehead when we express ourselves. It's always amazing just to let go and massage out all of the tension. However, before we get to the massage portion. Firstly, we need to open your pores. Now, in order to do that, we're going to steam them, which is a very gentle way of just opening the pores naturally with a little bit of heat, nothing unpleasant. Now, the water's hot, but the steam is just warm. It shouldn't hurt you at all. So I've got my ball here. Right now there's nothing in it, but I have this beautiful artisan cup. As you can see, it's very hot. 
wonderfully steaming. Now, before I pour it into the bowl, because the bowl has a wider surface area, it should cover more of your face more easily. I'm just going to start by using the mug and moving it over all the areas of your pores. You can close your eyes if you wish. Very good. Now, not too hot. Lovely. Lovely. This is going to make your skin receptive to the treatments that we're going to put on them. Okay? It's just going to mean they absorb everything better. And much more naturally. Okay, ready? Now I'm going to switch to the side handles. Just close your eyes and allow the steam to permeate your skin and your face and the heat to just relax all the muscles in your face, from your eyes to your eyelids, to growing super heavy, to your cheekbones and your jaw. Very, very I'm doing really well. Now, this steam is infused with a little bit of oil, a little bit of lavender, which gives it that color, but it's, um, it's all just to help the process along and obviously to smell better. You're doing wonderfully. And of course, the faint aroma of lavender just helps with the relaxation. Just letting the steam permeate the skin, open the pores. Lovely. That's looking, that's looking good. I'm just going to place this to one side. Before I touch your face, it's important that I uh, sterilize my hands, okay? Here, I've got some antibacterial solution. is that there's no need to wipe it off. It evaporates in the air. can take a while sometimes if you use slightly larger amount than normal. Okay, I'm going to start with a cleansing serum, okay? This is something that we apply to your face and then wipe off. It's just to clean out all the dirt, any uh, impurities in the skin and help make sure your face is radiant and nice and clean and clear, okay? It's got a little pipette. Pipette, pipette, pipette. So we just push the air up and then allow it to rise up like that. Beautiful. And then we just put a 
Jump in. Jump in. Jump in. Jump in. Lovely. I'm just gonna massage that in gently to your skin. There we go. Using circular motions helps to just remove any excess oil, impurities, anything like that, you know. Make sure to get into the T-zone, that's this area here. This is the area where most of us, most skin issues on the face tend to present. Certainly if you suffered from acne as a teenager, you'll be very familiar with this area. First bit. Second bit, I'm going to use a cotton pad. I've actually got two cotton pads here. One is to apply and one is to remove. So. Onto the back of there. Now just close your eyes, please. Rub that into your cheeks. Lovely, you're doing very, very well. Getting all the dirt out of your skin. And now because we opened your pores before, it's much easier to get in there and they're much more receptive. Fantastic. Doing very, very well. You are one of the lucky ones, you have very clear skin. Have you always had clear skin naturally? I wasn't so lucky, unfortunately, as a teenager. I suffered quite a bit from acne, but the puberty gods were kind enough to see that that didn't continue into my adult years, which I thank them every day for. Using circular motions to really get that into the skin. Make sure to disrupt and dislodge any dirt that's there. Really make sure that we're being thorough. Mm -hmm. Very good. Got a nice clean wipe, which I'm just going to dip in a little bit of water, and this is going to be used to remove um, remove the cleansing oil from your skin, and now we've got all the dirt to the surface. This is just going to wipe it away, wipe it all off, leaving you with a Beautifully clear face. Looking fantastic. Really good, you're doing great. Just wiping away all of that excess cleansing oil. Making sure your skin is absolutely positively radiant. Good, that looks nice and clear to me. Okay, I'm just gonna pop this away. Okay, obviously we've already removed the impurities, but really gives a beautiful look to your skin afterwards and just makes it glow and look naturally radiant. You know? This is from Sanctuary Spa. They recommend that you use this five minutes a day, once every other day. Um, 
just to give your skin a little bit of a break. You don't always want to wash your skin uh, excessively too many times a day, otherwise you can start to make it a bit greasy, but yeah. I can use a brush to apply this, okay? This is a very delicate small brush, it's designed for skin specifically, and it just means we can get it very specifically into all the spots. Okay. It's quite goopy. It's kind of dark in texture and color. Okay, squeeze a little bit out there. Probably gonna have to do that a couple of times just to make sure we get a whole face. Um, Painting down the center of your nose, just here, and then around into your cheeks over here. Good. If you could just close your eyes, I'm just gonna go over the top of your orbital bone. Now down underneath the top of your cheekbone, back up to the center. Very good. Just making sure this covers all the areas. Can add a little bit more. We are very freaky on lashes. Okay, just yeah. Okay, now close your eyes again. Just close your eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Good. Good. We're just gonna get the forehead. If you could just push your hair back. Don't want to get it into your hair. Cross here. Beautiful, beautiful. Just making sure we could do that. But actually, I'm just going to clip the top of your hair back. One here. And over this side, the one there. There we go. Good. A little bit more on the brush. off the excess. Okay, now just coming down onto your lips, just push them out like that. Very good. Now, together. If you could just turn your head that way. Just get it down this side of your jaw. Have a lovely face shape. It's uh, very striking. Back to the center. Okay, now over to this side. Uh, very good. You make sure not to get your ears. Okay, now because this is a thermal uh, face mask, it should start to feel nice and warm over the next five minutes. Again, it's not going to hurt, don't worry, but it uh, just needs about five minutes to do its work, so while we let it do its job, I would like to lead you through some breathing exercises as one of the main points of our spa session today is 
not just treatment, but relaxation, relaxation, relaxation. We're going to use the four, three, eight technique, okay? This means we breathe in for four. Hold for three, and then exhale. you and lead you through the whole thing. So what you need to do is just close your eyes, let your body just relax and follow my breathing instructions, okay? So, ready? Okay, inhale for one, two, three, four, hold, two, three, and doing very very well. You should be beginning to feel the nice warm sensation of the charcoal mask. Just really start to warm your face up and start to react. Wait until we remove it. The feeling is amazing. Good, you're doing very well. Breathing is so important for relaxation and for grounding yourself in any experience. If we're feeling bothered or anxious or angry, if we just ground ourselves, take a minute to just stop and control our breathing, it really, really can take this thing out of a situation and give you back control just as you feel like you're starting to lose it. Let's just remove that charcoal. This is nothing fancy, it's just a wipe and water. Eyes closed. Very good. Just removing all of that charcoal mask. How does that feel as we remove that? Doesn't it just feel great? Lovely sensation. Gives a really nice warm, tingly feeling on your skin. Fantastic. Doing so well. And your skin looks so good. Absolutely radiant. A little more water.
One last little spritz of water. Eyes closed. sensation as your skin just tingles from one side all the way over to the other. So tingly and relaxing. You're doing terrific. skin now before we add some niacinamide which is one of my personal favorite skincare products eyes closed no need to rub that in it's just a normal primer or like a makeup primer more of a skincare routine primer this stuff is incredible it's called niacinamide it's a strange name. It's got 1% zinc, apparently. Uh, this just helps to close off your pores and tighten your skin without it feeling dry. It's a amazing sort of toner slash finishing product for your skin. And uh, make sure that all the dirt that we've just got out of the pores, no, no new dirt can get back in while they're still open. Helps to close them off. Wonderful stuff, honestly. I use it, well, I should use it every day. I'll probably use it most days. Uh, this is probably my fifth bottle this year. But uh, we have some available in the shop if you would like to take some home with you. It's got a lovely little pipette there. So we're just gonna hold up the patch. I'm just going to massage that into your skin. Very good. Really good. Just tightening up all those pores. Sealing them off so impurities can't penetrate. And looking super young and radiant, which is a word that I use all the time, but it is completely descriptive for how you look right now. Just massaging that in. Very, very good. Just massaging in all of the product. Lovely, we are nearly done with your skincare. The last thing we're gonna use is Avena. It's a daily moisturizer. It's uh, non-greasy, but I got it to help some of my guests with rosacea and other skin conditions. Now, you don't have to have a skin condition to use it. It works just fine on normal skin, but it's especially useful if you suffer with anything itchy, red skin, or dryness. You should always put on the moisturizer last after the niacinamide. I'm gonna work it into my hands and then work it into your face as uh, there's less excess that way. I'm applying this. I'm going to be massaging your face. Just around here and around here and all the way back here and a little bit down your neck as well. And just around the back 
of your neck because we keep so much tension in the back of our necks. This is usually the part that people find to be the most pleasant. Whilst I'm just working this into your skin and massaging all around here and letting go of all the tension, I'm going to give you what's called a sleep induction. It sounds complicated, but really it just means a relaxing set of instructions delivered whilst I'm massaging you to help induce a state of sleep after which you're welcome to just lie back into the guest bed and you'll wake up feeling fully relaxed some people call this hypnosis which I suppose it is in a way but I'm not gonna try and get you to do anything silly like jump up and down on the spot or pretend that you speak with an Australian accent unless you already speak with an Australian accent which is a uh, well, very lucky but all it means is you're more susceptible and suggestible to the idea of sleep and as with all inductions it starts with your eyes closing and focusing on your breathing. Every time you breathe in deeply and fill up your lungs, you're gonna feel a tingling sensation starting at the back of your head. As you breathe out, there's a tension that leaves your muscles and the tingling sensation travels down through the back of your neck into your shoulders and your trapezius muscles that's this way as you breathe out you feel all the tension from those areas just leave you getting lighter and lighter from stress leaving your body and heavier and heavier breathing in all that relaxing relaxing air filling your lungs with only positive vibes positive energy feeling that tingling sensation travel down 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 now it's in your chest playing all over your chest moving down through your abs into your belly down your back into the bottom of your back which is where everybody keeps so much stress feeling all the heavy pressure in the bottom of your back just dissipate and leave now moving to the back of your bum through the front of your legs remembering to fill up your lungs deeply every single time and breathe out lovely lovely you're doing so well just traveling down your legs your legs are suddenly feeling really, really heavy you're becoming less and less aware of the room and anything exterior all your thoughts are just turning inwards everything is introverted to feel really heavy and in your mind's eye the sides start to close in but not in a claustrophobic way in a relaxing way all your troubles are outside of these two points and we're just gonna block them out this right here is your safe zone it's your sleepy zone and it's where we're gonna be spending tonight very very well very very well your 
eyelids feel so heavy and all you can focus on is the sound of my voice just lulling you deeply into sleep very very good very very good now I'm going to move to massaging your neck feeling all that tension just dissipating if any thought should present itself anything unpleasant come along you're just going to say silent gap, just opening up a little gap in our thoughts where we take control and say stop. All the pressures and anxieties of the day are going to try and penetrate, but we're not going to let them, are we? No, 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 we're not, because this right here is our safe zone. Yes it is. This is the area we reside in when we don't want to be bothered by the rest of the world. And it is very, very well protected and extremely well guarded. We could even say it is impenetrable. Impenetrable. Mm. All the tension in your neck, just leave your body. Getting heavier and heavier as you sink into the chair. Just sinking into the seat. That's it. All the stresses and worries of the day. Leaving your body as you just push them out. Just push them out. It's that simple. Just push them out. It's so simple, so easy. And here we are doing it. Doing it, doing it, doing it, doing it. You're doing fantastic. Just gently massaging all the tension that we keep under our eyes. Now everything in your peripheral has fully faded. The only thing you can think about or focus on is the sound of my voice just guiding you peacefully into sleep. Peacefully guiding you into sleep. Peacefully guiding you into sleep. You find the tone and the rhythm comforting predictable up and down tone peacefully guiding you into sleep now we should be relaxed and fully asleep we're going to sleep completely through till the morning we're not going to get up we're not going to be distracted and we are certainly not going to have any unpleasant dreams. The only dreams we're going to have are pleasant, peaceful, because this is our sanctuary. This is a haven. No matter what's bothering you during the day, it can't bother you now, because this time, this time right here, belongs to you, just you, it is your domain, it is your kingdom, you control every single thing that happens here, and if you say you don't want to be bothered by anxieties or thoughts or troubles, guess what, they can't get in, they are secure. into our sleep domain. This is your 
six please this is under your control and here you make the rules now just 